and then the Mr. Palmer's title the third time, the third time in a row. It, it feels good. It feels good. I'm going to make this my last one and give someone else a chance. My next plan is to, to try and compete more over, overseas to, you know, get my pro card so I could go to high heights. Ferguson, number eight. Also receiving this wonderful prize from John Bull, presented by national champion Ms. Amy Sands in the Bikini Division. It feels great that I actually got the overall title again. This is my second time with the overall. I always do well in my division. I always carry the gold for that. But it, you make you feel extra special when you get the overall. That's over everyone. So I, I feel awesome. I was quitting a couple of years back, and I'm still here because I love it. I love the sport. I love the camaraderie. I love the people. I love the fellowship in the gym. I love the, the healthy eating. The diet is hard, but once you have determination, you focus and you have stickability, you can do it. When you are on that stage, it is kind of difficult, but once you are there, you own that stage. And I, I am a person who believes in health, and bodybuilding is just not about just muscles. This keeps me going every day. This keeps me in shape. This actually is a mental thing as well. You go into some stress, some problems, some issues. Man, when you, get, you hit that gym and you start working on you forget about all your problems. Well, the show went exceptionally well. I had had a blast in Aruba. That was my first time ever competing in Aruba. Um, I got to compete against some fantastic athletes. Um, I got to um, get um, some good critiques from the judges as well on my performance, on my appearance. And it was pretty good. And I hope to go back to compete again um, in Aruba, um, maybe next year. Um, God's spare life and hopefully it goes well as planned uh, and that's how I want it to go. In terms of the journey, it's good to see the progress that I'm making year over year and that's part of the motivation to see what improvements you can make uh, from one year to the next and go to the competition and see this basically the same judges and they judge you according to your improvements and according to the, the competition at the show. Uh, so right now things are going good. I'm looking forward to the CAC competition this year in Dominican Republic. Next pro card qualifier, hopefully get it there. All I can do is um, take the um, judges', judges critiques, the audience critiques, and go, from, go back to the drawing board, work on what I need to work on, and just take it from there. Um, all I'm gonna do is um, use it to motivate me, continue to train hard, listen to my coach, um, diet right, um, condition my body right and just be prepared for next year. Um, just uh, loving the sport, um, being healthy, being fit um, at the age of 43 now going on 44, seeing what this body could do up to age of 99, uh, seeing how long I could keep this body in shape and hopefully just motivating the younger guys who are coming up to look at somebody at my age and say okay he's much older than I am and, 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 and he's doing it and he's continuing to do it and he's doing well at it so um, just motivating them to continue to, to come up in the sport and seeing that no matter how old you are, your body can still be as young as a 20-year-old.